Um, hi, this is a bit of a different start to my video, but basically today I'm going to do some painting, but not just any painting. I'm going to paint my light switch. <laughs> Now, I know that's really weird, but I've been looking on Pinterest, because I love a bit of Pinterest, and I just keep seeing people painting like random stuff, and I'm like, I can't do that. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna paint my light switch, and then I think I'm also gonna paint my phone case. So yeah, I'm gonna take you along with the light switch that I'm painting. Um, I mean, it's just, you know, a standard light switch. So I think I'm gonna do like a cloud kind of theme with like pastel colors. Cause basically my mum was like, you can paint the light switch as long as it matches your room. And I feel like that'll kind of match. So yeah, first thing I'm gonna do is I am just gonna put some masking tape around the sides just so it doesn't get on the wall. Cause you know, I don't really want that. I've done that. I've just put masking tape around the side just to protect the walls. The colors I'm using today are just acrylic paints by the way so i'm just going to use um pink blue green and purple but i am gonna um oh i can't think of the right word i am gonna like dilute them down with white to make them pastel um i am just wearing my dressing gown please don't at me it's just that it's really cold <laughs> so yeah i've just got some white here as you can see so i'm just gonna add this just came in the post and i'm super happy it's like a really nice purple so that's quite drippy i'm just gonna add okay i kind of didn't want to add that much but it kind of just poured out so and then i'm gonna do pink that I'm using so I've got like a pale pastel blue pastel pink pastel purple and then like pastel -y, greeny turquoisey color okay so here I am just painting the light switch so I'm starting with the color blue um, and I'm just going to be doing like a gradient effect this was actually quite a nice surface um, to paint on because it was really smooth and the paint seemed to stick quite well. Um, so yeah, I'm just doing uh, the blue bit at the top first and then also painting like the top of the actual light switch as well. Uh, so yeah, I'm just going to continue doing that and I'm just going to go down with each different colour. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to speed this up now. just done one coat I know it's not like blended amazingly but I'll fix that on the second coat because it's just I really need it to dry a little bit um but yeah I think it looks okay yeah I'm pretty happy with it and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add some clouds and stars and moons and stuff like that and make it all edgy so I just did another coat on the light switch really hard to blend the colours on a light switch because it's not a surface I'm used to painting. I mean it is nice and smooth like to paint on but you can see like this I just um but I am going to add like some clouds in that so I feel like it will look okay even though some bits aren't blended 
just because I'm really lazy and I can't be bothered to wait and then paint another coat and I also don't want it to be too thick and then it like might like peel off and you know all of that so I'm now going to paint some clouds uh this is like basically dry so oh, I don't know where I'm gonna so I'm literally I'm just kind of like dabbing Like so, and then I'm just going to do a bigger one. I am going to add like obviously some more depth to them, but I just want to get the white down first. So I'm just going to continue doing that and then I'll come back to do the like shadow kind of thingy. <laughs> okay, so you can see that I painted the rest of the clouds. So now I'm just going to add like a little shadow underneath with this pink. I know that obviously it does look a bit weird right now. And I definitely should have waited for the paint to dry at the bottom because it's not dry, but... <laughs> YOLO so yeah I'm just like dabbing a bit of pink underneath I don't really know what them random bits are on the actual switch but and then I will come back to add like a bit more white I just need that layer at the bottom like the pink layer, sorry, the shadow, to dry a bit. So yeah, that's how that's looking at the moment. It's looking super cute. Um, hopefully my mum will like it. I don't think she has much choice now, but you know. Um, so yeah, just gonna leave, don't know. I'm gonna leave that like that for now. So I kind of forgot to film me doing the stars and that. So I'm really sorry about that, but basically, this is what it looks like. I'm just ignoring like my wall around it. It's just where, that's just how the wall was when we painted it. But yeah, I'm super pleased with how it came out. I've also added some glitter. So I know it's not like perfect, like if you look up close, like it's not perfect, but like from far away, I think it just looks sick. So I'm so happy with that. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a bit of a random one, um, but yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna do my foam case. So the thing is, I've already done this twice and I hated it. So I like scrubbed it off, as you can see, it's like really scratched and has like bits of paint here and there. Um, so I think I need to do like thinner layers and let it dry because it is like a different material. So yeah, see how that goes. I've just got the case here and I've got some colors here. I'm kind of running a bit low on white, so let's just hope that this will, I'm just making sure that that is dry because it doesn't seem to stick too well when you put water, which I learned from earlier. So I'm just gonna get a nice pastel pink first. And I'm gonna paint and we're going to do a thin layer because I've learned my lesson. <laughs> so as you can see, um, I've now let that layer dry from before. So now I'm just going to start painting on the clouds. Um, so the paint that I'm going to be using is actually like a furniture paint, so it's like a matte drying chalky finish paint, only because my white acrylic paint has run out, which is so sad. So I'm going to be using this. It does still work, it's just a little bit thick. Um, so yeah, just a tip for you guys, if you ever run out of white acrylic paint, you can use furniture paint. So yeah, I'm just going to paint the clouds now. The technique I use is pretty much just kind of like dabbing, as you can see. I'm just using like 
a kind of like petal brush I don't really I don't think that's what it's called but yeah so I'm just going to paint the clouds the white bits first and then I'll come back to like add the shadows and things like that so yeah I'm going to speed this up now so enjoy watching me paint I've painted um, all of the clouds here. Um, it's come out much better. Like if you saw the first two, they were literally just hideous. And I was so disappointed in myself. So I'm just gonna add some shadows underneath and I'm gonna use this bright pink. So I'm just gonna put it right at the bottom. I don't know how this is gonna, gonna go because I'm using different paint, but let's start with some dots just in case. Okay, I need I need more paint. I've done all the stars and um, like little moons and that. Oh my, oh my goodness. <laughs> it's okay, <laughs> I think. Uh, okay, no it isn't because I just dropped it in this massive glob of paint so that's fantastic let me just i don't even know how i'm gonna fix that let me just try and fix that and then i'll be <gasps> oh my god look why does everything wrong happen to me so i tried to fix this and i added like some pink down here and then just some random bits of color it's kind of annoyed me but i'm just gonna put a cloud over it and hope for the best so here is actually um, the finished result of the phone case. So I added like some gems and some little cactus stickers and then made it into clouds at the top and also added um, my initials with these little like glittery stickers. I mean it's still not exactly what I wanted but it will do I suppose. Um, so yeah thank you so much for, for watching this video. I've just attached a picture here as well of both the light switch and the phone case together um, in like better lighting and um, so thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed if you want to see any more painting videos like this let me know in the comments below because there's loads of other things that i can paint bye